lifting operations are potentially hazardous. Penny Hydraulics suggest referring to the Construction Plant Hire Association and Association of Lorry Loader Manufacturers and Importers Best Practice Guide for the Management of Lifting Operations with Lorry Loaders prior to planning, supervising, using or maintaining lorry loaders. In addition, when using Penny Hydraulics swing lift cranes, the following operating instructions should be followed. Before operation, read the operating instructions and ensure all persons involved with the lift are trained and competent. Ensure that the crane has a valid certificate of thorough examination. A crane would normally have an examination every 12 months. Carry out a visual examination of the crane and mounting for obvious signs of defect or leakage. See daily checks in operating manual. Check locality for potential hazards such as overhead electric cables, nearby structures, public roads or paths. Also pay attention to the below ground hazards such as drains. Ensure that the vehicle is on firm and level ground with the handbrake applied and wheel chocks deployed where necessary. Where fitted, turn on the crane cab switch or isolator and for pendant controlled cranes, plug in the pendant control to the control box on the side of the power unit cover. Extend the stabilizer leg or legs if fitted and adjust to ground level using a suitable stabilizer pad. On hydraulic stabilizer legs, ensure that valves are closed before commencing the lift. Ensure the wire rope is running off the bottom of the winch drum. The crane is now ready to use. Operate the crane smoothly and with caution. The functions are clearly marked on the hold to run buttons or handles. Keep tension on wire rope at all times to ensure even winding. Attach the load to the hook using suitable certified attachments only. Forewarn of the lifting operation to any nearby persons. Keep clear of the suspended load and never allow any person to pass beneath it. Never exceed the maximum capacity stated on the crane load plate displayed on the boom and do not lift persons. On completion of the operation, ensure the crane is folded into the travelling position and that the stabiliser legs are withdrawn and secured. Stow the crane using the rope hook and all other locking points as per manufacturer's instructions. Detach the pendant control and where applicable, isolate the crane power.